a project for you if you're interested. Yeah? I'm ready to go to Broadway, but for him, I'll go anywhere. There's an intrepid quality to people like Leonard. They're willing to take a shot over and over again. I met my wife in 1950. She brought up the gay thing. He never ran away from any identity. Leonard was gay Jewish before anybody was gay and Jewish. Off-Broadway is a little bit more challenging than Broadway these days because it takes longer for a show to take off. I'm crazy busy. I got a show opening on Monday, and I'm out of my fucking mind. How old is this budget? Older than you. Because I'm we the do producer. Have a problem because I'm saying you can't have it. I want this it out. Is what I'm, all right. Then take my name off the show. Forget oh, it. don't be silly. No, forget it. You don't, don't listen. You don't long. listen to me. He sent a fifty thousand yesterday, and he's sending another fifty uh, uh, on Friday. I hate this fucking business. Look for the good. This show is going to be up, and it's going to be great. The most interesting stories are the ones that didn't go well. We not only won the Tony Award, we won the Pulitzer Prize. Then we lost every nickel. You've done 100 shows. These things come up, they go down. Never as bad as this. What are you looking at me like that for? Well, because. Look, you don't know the business, so don't start telling me what to do. It's a fucking nightmare. So do you think this will be your last show? is a Broadway legend. To our dear friend, Leonard Soloway. Hi, Leonard. Olympia, my darling treasure. Leonard always tells the truth. Sometimes it's brutal. I suddenly was a hero on Broadway because I told him to go fuck himself. I'm in. Hello, and welcome to theater.